Welcome to Tech Nation, the channel dedicated to exploring the latest technology trends and innovations. Today, we're taking a look at the exciting world of space exploration and colonization. Humans have always been fascinated by the mysteries of space, and we've come a long way since the first satellite was launched into orbit in 1957. Today, we have a number of powerful telescopes and spacecraft that are helping us to explore the cosmos in unprecedented detail. But we're not just looking out into space, we're also working to establish a permanent human presence in space. One of the most ambitious projects in space exploration is the International Space Station. Launched in 1998, the ISS is a collaboration between NASA, the Russian Space Agency, the European Space Agency, and other international partners. It serves as a laboratory for research in microgravity, as well as a test bed for technologies that will be needed for long-duration space missions. But the ISS is just the beginning. NASA is currently working on the Artemis program, which aims to return humans to the Moon by 2024, and establish a sustainable presence on the lunar surface by the end of the decade. This program will also pave the way for future missions to Mars and other destinations in the solar system. Private companies are also getting into the space game, with companies like SpaceX and Blue Origin working on reusable rockets and spacecraft that can take people and cargo to the International Space Station, and eventually to the Moon and Mars. But it's not just about sending people to other worlds, it's also about creating self-sustaining colonies on those worlds. This would require developing new technologies for things like food production, energy generation, and waste management. Scientists are currently researching on how to utilize the resources available on other planets to sustain human life, such as growing crops in Martian soil and using ice on the moon as a source of water. Recent missions to Mars, such as NASA's Perseverance rover, have provided us with a wealth of data about the planet's geology, climate, and potential habitability. For example, scientists have discovered evidence of past liquid water on the Martian surface, as well as signs that the planet may have once had a more Earth-like climate. These discoveries have led many to believe that Mars may have once been home to microbial life, and could potentially host life again in the future. The search for life on Mars is also closely tied to the goal of human colonization. If we are going to establish a human presence on Mars, we need to know if the planet can support human life. This would require developing new technologies for things like food production, energy generation, and waste management. Scientists are currently researching on how to utilize the resources available on Mars to sustain human life, such as growing crops in Martian soil and using ice on the planet as a source of water. But it's not just about survival, it's also about creating a thriving colony on Mars. This would require not only the development of new technologies but also a deep understanding of the planet's environment and resources. It would also require a deep understanding of the psychological, social and cultural aspects of living and working in a colony on a remote planet. Both NASA and private companies such as SpaceX have ambitious plans for manned missions to Mars in the coming decades. NASA's Artemis program, for example, aims to send humans to Mars in the 2030s, while SpaceX's Starship spacecraft is also being developed for interplanetary travel. These missions will not only be a test of our technological capabilities but also a test of our ability to adapt and thrive on a new world. Space exploration and colonization is a challenging and ambitious goal, but the potential benefits for humanity are enormous. It will not only help us to better understand our place in the universe, but also provide a new frontier for human expansion and innovation. In conclusion, the search for life on Mars and the goal of human colonization are closely tied together, and both have the potential to greatly benefit humanity. As we continue to explore and learn more about the planet, we're getting closer to answering one of humanity's oldest and most profound questions. Are we alone in the universe?